Ryerson students have themselves a brand new home. The Student Learning Center, or SLC, had its soft opening yesterday. The building itself has eight floors of dedicated study space for students. The SLC has opened up to some very positive reviews. Yeah, the new facility is great. Uh, you know, state-of-the-art building, there's a lot of staff, uh, everyone seems pretty enthusiastic. I feel like it's a really nice environment and people want to study, like it gave me a vibe to study. The fourth floor, known as the Garden, is the new home of Ryerson's Student Learning Support, or SLS. SLS provides a lot of services to students, such as academic accommodations, writing support, and math support. SLS's services used to be spread out all along Ryerson's campus. But now that everything is in one place in the SLC, SLS believes that they'll be able to better serve students. It's clearer, right? So a student doesn't, like a student can just say, oh, I think I need some extra help uh, with my writing, or I think I'm, ha I'm having a problem in my math course, I don't know where to go. Now there's, a one, there's one place to come on campus to get that help. The first two days, well, they've been pretty busy ones. SLS has been running workshops around the clock. Do you think that now that the services are in this new building, do you think that a lot more students are going to use them? Uh, yeah, I feel like a lot more people are going to be using them because it's, it has like a better environment where like it's, I feel like it's safer, where you could just like, everybody could just like show up. Of course, yeah, they're more accessible and they're just right up the library. We love being um, close to students like this because before we were tucked away in spaces where, in basements, <laughs> and now we're, we're in a pretty happening space. The grand opening of the SLC isn't expected to happen until late March, but student learning services are fully up and running, and the students, well, they're clearly taking full advantage. Michael Norton, Ryerson Television News.